Yes. Come on, Hattie. Forget about the fat, sir. Vlad's shut up. But he's a serf, and you're a countess. Uh, talking about serfs. Oh, hey, Nico. Where's Roman? <laughs> Good question. Hey, Yoko, your dumb cousin isn't here. Go get me a coffee. What? Get me a fucking coffee! Come on, I'll get you one. What? You keep staring at me. I'll burst one of your eyeballs. Gorgeous. This guy's a fucking creep. Give him a break. He's new in the country. I can see that. Did you walk here from 1985? Yeah. Excellent. Now stop fucking staring at me. I mean, I know I'm good looking and everything, but come on. Uh, hey, Mallory. Hey, man. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> About time. Vlad, Vladdy boy, what's going on? Roman. Roman boy. You tell me what's going on. Mass aftershave, what is that? Sex pest? No, <laughs> it's where is my fucking money? I, I had it. I, I had some of it. Then those Albanians you said you would deal with came and smashed my computer. So it's my fault? I, I didn't say that. Good. Anyway, Nico dealt with him. Brought Darden's arm, then beat up a couple more. Then we teach him a real lesson. <laughs> is that so? I tell you what. While you don't pay, maybe you and Nico can do me few favors. <laughs> Good. Why not? Late of Vlad. What? The phone's ringing. Hey. Yeah. Okay. No, I, I can't do it. My cousin will do it. Yes, he can drive. No, he's not a cop. His name is Nico. You'll be right over. Nico. Sorry to ask, cousin. Can you go pick up Jermaine, one of my regulars? He's over on Rotterdam Hill on Mohawk Avenue? Whatever. What was this all about? Nico came in looking for you, and Vlad told him to get him a fucking coffee, and Nico didn't want to. Coffee? What was he thinking? I know. For coming. Can you take me over to Masterson Street? Masterson Street it is, Jermaine. Shit, I thought Roman was gonna pick me up. I need someone I can trust for this run. I'm Roman's cousin. If you can trust him, you can trust me. Ah, uh, he told me about you. You're Nico, right? A hotshot ladies' man cruising around the Mediterranean, breaking hearts and making millions? 
Yeah, I traded in the yacht for this cab. <laughs> That's exactly the kind of bullshit I can imagine Roman making up. You've got to give him credit for his imagination. Yeah, you got it. I had a feeling you sounded too good to be true. The question is, are you willing to get your hands dirty? My hands haven't been clean for a long time. Being here in Liberty City is just making them dirtier. Okay, okay. I gotta pick up some hop. That door isn't meant to be open. Wait here while I take a look. The cops are on to me. Get us out of here. I'm spinning out, man. Get these cops off my tail. Help, man! You gotta shake these cops! Shake! You nearly killed me, man! You ain't like the other drivers! Things. I'm looking for something. Good luck finding them. How's the hunt been going so far? It is not really started yet. I'm getting settled in, you know. Roman has had some issues with loan sharks that needed to be resolved. There's this asshole called Vlad, who he owes money to as well. Good luck with that. Well, I was speaking to our reporter. Yo, yo, what's up? I just want to say, communities got to take pride in what they do, man. And that's what my project and the movie being made about my project is all about. It's like hip-hop back when we invented that shit. Before it went all commercial and shit. When it was a couple of street cats and a block party and stuff, you know? That's what we're doing now. Taking the community over. Okay, we're here. Thanks, man. Keep looking after Roman, all right? Formerly famous... Trying to relaunch himself. With a new show. He's still trying to raise funding for the venture. He spoke to reporter Eric House. Eric, it's Radio 2.0. You could even say it's Radio 3.14. I mean, kind of like how I stretch on to infinity. But like Roman, I got your friend Jermaine where he wanted to go. Good, Nico. Thanks. Hey, can't talk. See you soon. What does that mean? Look, I'm not being vague. It just sounded good. In broker, on air. I'm sorry. You better start remembering important people, you stump peasant. Your cousin owes me a lot of money. If you don't want to make things real difficult for him, you are going to come to Kamrat Bar in Mohawk. I have a work for you. Check your local pharmacy.